Hi, once again, and greetings from TLC Church, Pastor Bob here. We have hummingbirds coming to our hummingbird feeder now. <laughs> I think hummingbirds are one of the neatest of creations that God has made. I recently read a story about a hummingbird. It was written by a biology teacher. He said, one day, uh, this little girl brought in a dead hummingbird in her hand. She said she found it on the sidewalk on her way to school. But this teacher, he began to wonder if maybe the hummingbird wasn't quite dead. So he said, we took the hummingbird and I took the little girl down to the uh, lab, the science lab, and we mixed up uh, some white cane sugar into some water and uh, we held the little hummingbird in our hand and we put its beak into this little pail of, uh, of sugar water. He said, we held it there for several minutes. And then he says, I saw it with my own eyes. The little tongue began to flick in and out of its beak and it began to drink the sugar water. And the little bird lived and it flitted away. <laughs> you ever watch a hummingbird? They can fly in any direction and up and down and all around and they just take off like a helicopter. I mean, they're just gone. That little girl, you know, could have just taken that bird and tossed it into the bushes and just forgot about it. But her actions that day actually made the difference between life and death for one of God's beautiful creatures. <laughs> You know, God taught us some lessons from birds. Yeah. In Matthew chapter 6, in verse 26, it says, Look at the birds. They don't worry about tomorrow's harvest, nor are they concerned about the future. Why? Because your heavenly Father takes care of them and feeds them. Aren't you worth much more to him than a bird? Now, sometimes we know that God uses us as he did that little girl to save that bird. But that little bird, you know, flits around. It doesn't worry about the weather. It doesn't worry about anything. And God is asking us to be like the birds because we're much more valuable than they are. Father, we thank you that we can learn lessons from nature because you have taught us in your word many things from your creation. I pray that you'll bless us today and keep us safe Help us not to worry, but to have hope because we are your children. In Jesus' name, amen.